I have got a new favorite tool for the Tormach. Check this out. It rips through aluminum, folks. It's the sheer hog from the folks at AB Tools. Let's whip up some speeds and feeds, and then let's rip through some aluminum, folks. Welcome to another episode of NYC CNC. We're in SolidWorks with the HSM Cam plugin, which folks, I love. I'm gonna have a video out next week on it, more detail. Today, let's focus on this hog shear. Speaking of which, I'll have a link to this in the video description, but this is their website. And if we pull up the PDF, you can see we're using the one inch, uh, excuse, we're using the SH100. So it's a three quarter shank, which works great for our Tormach with a one inch cutting diameter with one flute, which will plunge in the Z 195 bucks, which includes the uh, wrench and I think one insert. Yeah, one insert. So we're running at 5,100 RPMs and 30 inches a minute, um, all which ways, roughing, cut, cutting, plunging, etc. We are machining down 0.25 inches. That's the depth of this pocket. And we are, what was I going to mention? Um, okay. So we're taking a 0.4 inch step over. So that's 40% of one inch. And we are ramping in with a helix two degrees um, with a 0.8 inch step over on the heel on the ramp so if we simulate this and again the simulation is the only thing i wish they did a little bit better but boy this is i'm really liking uh hsm show stock i gotta check finishing the ramp in and coming around like so we pull, I pulled this up in G wizard and this may not be all perfect, but I think we're running a quarter inch depth of cut 0.4 width of cut 5,100, 30, 31 inches a minute. We're looking at something like a three cubic inch material removal rate and only about 0.6 horsepower. But this is this, this, my spindle started to sound, um, taxed after at a higher feed rate. So I'm guessing I've got some sort of a limit that I'm bumping up against. I gotta talk to the folks at Tormach. Maybe I'll get a load meter. It would be actually quite helpful for some of this testing stuff. But enough about that, let's go make some chips. Folks, how friggin' awesome is that? I think that's pretty awesome, folks. Actually reminds me a lot of the Superfly that Tormach makes where they're driving a single insert with a, you know these smaller milling machines. It optimizes their ability to use base mills or, or indexable end mills like that. So I think that's a huge win. Funny enough, I found, I'd heard about the shear hog. I keep calling it the hog shear, I think it's the shear hog. I heard about it from somebody and then I saw AB Tools has a great Instagram page, and then I realized the two are the same, and I'm really glad I ordered it. It's it's going to be a go-to tool in my repertoire because it actually produces a great surface finish. Um, you, if you happen to notice some some uh, lines around the periphery, that's actually an HSM thing. We'll get into that next week. Um, so that's been a big win for me, folks. I hope you enjoyed it. I love seeing this thing remove three cubic inches a minute. That's fun. So with that, folks, take care. See you tomorrow for the widget.